Hi, Leo. All right, you guys. Oh, no. What would you like to talk to my Leo's about, please? There's another message over on Blue for you guys if you haven't seen it yet, okay? Okay, here we go. I'm gonna do some channeling with three cards. The Eight of Pentacles. It feels like to me giving it your all. It feels like to me you've been working really hard, um, putting all of your efforts into a situation and um, you're ready to, to, to reap the benefits of it, um, Leos. So it's like, I'm being obedient. I'm doing the things that, you know, spirit is telling me to do. Uh, is it working? Is it working is the question. Am I doing enough? Am I doing enough as far as um, my, with, with my abilities of, uh, um, Am I given everything? I feel like you are. I feel like they are. Um, I feel like they are uh, very much so watching you. Um, I'm hearing spirits say, don't give up. Don't give up. Don't give up hope. Don't give up putting in your efforts. Keep pushing. Spirit is saying to me that you're going to need this later on down the line. This sort of grind, this sort of hustle, this sort of mentality. Um, this is where you're building your foundation. This is how you're building your foundation, your core, your your the core of you. This is you. You're learning about yourself through this period i don't know what you're going through i don't know if this is resonating with love or career or your life in general that's like your life in general period um but i do know that it feels like um this is the this is building you the very core of you like who you should um be at this time um, who you who you're gonna need to be later on down the line? I'm lighting the frankincense. I totally forgot to do it before I press record. I'm like, I don't smell it. <laughs> of course you don't, Amira. <laughs> of course you don't, cause you ain't freaking dang gonna put it. Lord, pray for me, y'all, in a good way though. Don't be. Putting no negative energy my way. Those that try to spirit. Send that shit to the light, please. Alright. Um. So <laughs> I'm sitting here like I don't smell it. <laughs> anyway, sorry about that, y'all. Uh like I said, it feels like to me, um, practice makes perfect. I feel like you're building something for yourself. And it's going to be it's going to be prosperous for you. Look at this, the lovers card, and you're learning how to love yourself too, and what you will accept and won't accept. You're also learning that you don't just run from relationships; you stay and fight, even though the times may be getting tough. Um, and also um, work as well. You're learning a lot with this Eight of Pentacles. I feel like they, they brought this out. I feel like Spirit is saying, um, um, I 
they may be ready for love. Third party, home, mask. Ooh, what'd you deal with? Because the grass is greener on the other side. Did you just ghost the situation? You've been alone for two years. You've been alone for two years. You did, you were. You were alone for two years, spiritual awakening. They can really send you someone. This is new. Ex-lover. That ex-lover did you wrong. You felt hard for them, huh? Hmm. Reconciliation. Surrender. Liquid courage. Romantic feelings. Divine intervention. Date. Somebody else is entering into your life. And I feel like spirit is bringing this person into your life to kind of like shake things up and liven, th liven, liven things up. Um, Leo's. It could be a Gemini or a Virgo for pentacles. Release. Someone's not wanting to release you, let you go. Someone's not wanting to release you or let you go. Um, and you're comfortable with that, but you're not supposed to be. Okay, so I wanted to, um, I, as I was talking, I was asking Spirit, um, is this going to resonate or is this a continuation of the other reading that's on Blue Tarot? And Spirit is saying, no, it isn't. So there's your answer. This is a new spread. They're saying no, so I'm going to go with what they're telling me because they haven't felt me wrong um, with you guys. So... You and your person is is long is learning how to love on each other and hold on to each other. Sometimes it's okay. I know that being greedy is seen as a bad such bad, but when it comes to loving your person and being greedy to you know and loving your person, in your case, I feel like there's an exception. You know, there is. It's okay. Because at this stage in your relationship, it feels like you need this or y'all need this. And I feel like this lady is pointing out, aren't y'all supposed to be in love? Shouldn't you be putting in the work? As much as we want relationships to be easy or connections to be easy. What's at the bottom? It's not going to be. Ten of Pentacles, abundance. You know, I thought that this was going to be the card, that the lover's card was going to be this card, and it's at the bottom of the deck. Hallelujah. I was like, oh, the Ten of Pentacles are going to come out after the Eight of Pentacles, and it's sitting there at the bottom of the deck. I feel like y'all are supposed to hold on to each other, do the work. Also... Career-wise, they're going to love you. They're going to love you. Expect nothing less from where you work. I know I said three, but I'm, I'm going to grab two more. A better understanding about love. Brave. Being very brave, too. Okay. So, what I'm hearing is you're, you want your person to understand you and your person wants to understand you. And this goes for work, too. So, keep that in mind. Okay? So, put this for both work and romance. For your for your finances in you in you in yeah, um, 
I want to make sure I'm wording this right, Leos. Your person wants to better understand you and you want to better understand them as well. So it's like reciprocal energy here. I'm getting that um, once y'all both understand that, the real work is going to be put in where y'all are going to be building a legacy together. That's what I'm getting here. Gemini, you could definitely be dealing with a Gemini. I said I was going to do three cards, but I feel like I need to do more. So I'm going to do, I'm going to pull more. See, the eight of wands communication, y'all, the, everything is going to go according to plan. No running this time. I think that's what I should name this. I was going to name it something else, but I feel like no running this time. I'm going to get the next three and I'm going to let you guys go. Your nerves will get the best of you and you can sabotage this by being so guarded. Okay? So be very, very careful here because what you ask for is in front of you as far as your career and your love life. Hopefully this helps. I'll speak to you guys later. Thank you so much for all the birthday wishes. You guys are freaking dang on amazing. And I love you too. Message.